Up first, this entrepreneur has created a fitness platform to help moms get in shape and embrace their strength, sexiness, and sassiness from the inside out. We're talking with Rachel Duran, founder of Sassy Mom Fitness. Hi, it's, it's great to be here. Thank you for yes. joining you. Um, so Sassy Mom Fitness, I, when I created it, it was, it was because of my own journey that I went through mm -hmm. as a young girl too as well. Yeah. I started with an eating disorder when I was younger. I had anorexia. Then I went into the diet pills and then the diet books and the fat shake diet. So my journey has taken a lot. Um, so my own journey was to create something where moms can actually do in the comfort of their home. Yeah. And be able to, I wanted to change fitness and health in a different way. Uh -huh. More than just about dieting, it's not about that. It's about creating a place where you're, you're being mindful and thoughtful of what you're eating. Uh -huh and mindful and thoughtful of how you are um, viewing your own self, yes. your own body, you know, creating a place where you can just be yourself, be the best vision of yourself, and whatever that may take. I mean, it could be from, it doesn't have to involve food all the time, it can be like um, stepping in the mirror in the bathroom and giving three positive things about yourself. Oh, every that's day. a powerful activity. And maybe taking small steps to a smart change. Uh -huh. It doesn't like, you know, to maybe taking 15 minutes out of your day for yourself. Yeah. And learning how to do that. How am I going to do that when I'm, you know, when the, when the world's chaotic? You know, it's you're so having hard, kids. Yeah. <laughs> maybe you're a working mom. Maybe you're a stay-at-home mom. But mm -hmm. you're completely just, I know in my day, it's, it's chaotic. It's, it's just like, how am I going to do this? How am I going to fit this in? Right. So sometimes we just need that. 10 to 15 minute break just for to, you like a reboot yes because you can't be really you know productive in your day if you don't take the time for yourself yeah and I wanted it to not just be like I didn't want Sassy Mom Fitness to just be another like fitness and diet studio and mm -hmm. that's not where I wanted to come across I you wanted, wanted to have your unique voice in it yes yeah and it's powerful yeah so I, I mean I tell my story to my clients like this uh -huh. is my story What's your story? Mm -hmm. Why are you here? What is it that you want me to help you with? Uh -huh. You know, and that's when we take the small steps to smart change, and that's where it's supposed to start. Yeah. It's with you. It's about being mindful and thoughtful, but also embrace, you know, because it's also being, you know, mental, physical, emotional, spiritual. You have to find this food that's going to feed your soul in the inside and mm -hmm. bring out the outside. Yeah. So that's something I really wanted to bring out. And every single mom out there, women, it just, it just to embrace themselves uh -huh. and empower themselves and inspire who they truly want to be within themselves. Yeah. So what is one of your favorite tips for that first step? You know, for someone who has, you know, they've kind of let themselves go. Um, they don't really take the time for themselves and they focus more on their family and their responsibilities than really feeding themselves and taking care of their own bodies and health? I would say, first of all, why, what, when you take that step, you have to be committed to yourself. You have to have that readiness to change. So you have to ask yourself, are you ready to change? And what is it, what are you going to do to get there? Mm -hmm. And what are the steps, the small steps that you're going to take to get there? Mm -hmm. And if you need the support and how much support do you need to keep yourself accountable? Okay. Like, when you look at yourself in the mirror, what do you see? Yeah. You have to ask yourself, what do you see and what do you want? What do you want to yeah, see? Yeah, what yeah. do you want to see? And, you know, just be positive about yourself. And, but to create that, you have to create a space that's going to be able to, to allow you to do that. Because it's not mm -hmm. one size fits all. Yeah. It, there's no diet out there that's going to quick fix you because I tried right. them all. <laughs> <laughs> so it's not going to do that for you. It's going to briefly maybe help you. Mm -hmm. But you have to change what's inside first yeah. and how you see yourself first. Then you can you know. Then you can be able to, you know, t make the change that you want. Yeah. Or you want to see. Beautiful. Thank you. So, is there anything else that you'd like to, you know, leave our audience with to, you know, give them that empowerment to take that first step and really, um, and really um, put themselves first for the first time? I would say, like that's, I would say, live in the live in the present moment and enjoy the simple things in life because that's what we have. I mean, you have to. <laughs> don't enjoy life it's, 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 it's that's what it is it's not about dieting it's just about living life uh -huh. so, yeah, that's about it <laughs> well thanks Rachel thank for you. all that great great information and for telling your story thank you it was hard <laughs> <laughs> but it's just 
hard for me to tell my story because it's it, but now it's not anymore. But at first it was. Yeah. But if that changes someone else's perspective and their in their life, that's great because yeah. you know diets just don't work. Yeah, they, they do. You know, they just don't. Yeah. Well, thank you You're for welcome. telling your story with our with you know with our community. Thank you.